The heart of Confucian philosophy is that you understand your place within the hierarchy of the universe. Ideally, it is within the family that individuals learn how to live well and become good members of the wider community. Moral duty involves deep reverence for one's parents and worship of ancestors. You need to understand your place in the scheme of things. Honour your elders, especially those who brought you into the world, and honour those who brought them into the world and those who brought them into the world and so on. Living well, then, is not just about how you treat the living, it's also about how you show respect to the dead. Traditionally, when a parent dies, a son or daughter spends three years in ritual mourning. This period mirrors the three years when the child was completely dependent on parental care. Ancestors' names and lineage are recorded on special tablets that are hung in the home, and these household shrines are the focus of worship. Underlying all this is a view about social harmony, which comes from recognising hierarchies and honouring elders. Confucius continues to exert a powerful sway over Chinese culture two and a half thousand years after his death. Though, true to his own philosophy, he said that he wasn't an original thinker, but owed his own ideas to the wisdom of those who preceded him.